um, today is my first day as a free woman. Um, I'm free from homework. <laughs> It feels so good not to have to worry about like doing a lab or did I complete all of my homework or discussions and all that stuff. So like this week I'm just kind of not having to worry about doing anything in, in terms of schoolwork, which is really, really nice. It's a big relief. The past couple of months have been pretty hard, like juggling schoolwork and um, adjusting to being home and all that stuff. So I'm feeling really good today. Um, my mom also had today off, so we went to the mall and did kind of like some window shopping and stuff. Um, and I got makeup from Target or like my mom bought it for me, but got a new lipstick and some eyeliner. Um, I don't know if you could tell from the video, but I really like them. They're nice. Um, and yeah, yeah, I had a really good day. Um, after this video, I'm going to watch Norseman, finally, because <laughs> uh, I'm curious to see, like, you said that you really liked the humor in that show, um, so I, yeah, I want to see, like, what it's about. Um, I'm kind of hoping that it'll be, like, a historical drama or historical show, um, so I've, like, been really into that lately. Um, I started watching Chernobyl, which is on HBO. And it's a really, really good show. It's kind of like documenting what happened uh, or it's a dramatization of what happened in Russia, like in the immediate area and kind of the politics behind it um, when the Chernobyl nuclear accident happened. Um, yeah, and you should watch it. I think we have HBO. If not, you can you can borrow my parents' password and watch it over there because it's like definitely worth seeing. Um, I also started reading again. I think I already told you that I read this book. I am like a painfully slow reader, but I finished this book in one day, which is I think the first time I've ever done that. <laughs> um, and yeah, I really like it. Um, it's like a science horror book. Um, and like the narrator is speaking like from first person and, um, there's like subtle changes in kind of their state of mind and their attitude towards what's going on in this book and I think that is kind of like the best part um it just yeah it's really unsettling um and really really good like after I read it I had to listen to a comedy podcast to kind of have like a palate cleanser and be able to go to sleep because I was just like for better for lack of a better word I was like shook after I read this book um so yeah I'm gonna try to pick up the next next book because it's a trilogy um yeah really good I can send it to you if you want to read it I know you don't really like horror movies but it isn't really like jump scare ish it's just kind of unsettling I think that's the best way to describe it it's just it's yeah it's uncomfortable <laughs> but in a good way um I'm finally going to watch Endgame on Wednesday with Michelle um even though I already know like two or three of the deaths that are supposed to happen. Um, but that's okay. It'll be nice to see um, how they actually kind of like, I guess, close this end of like a movie era. Um, so yeah, even though I know it's like some spoilers, I'm still really excited to see it. And I will let you know what I think about it after I watch it. Um, I've also started playing or like picking up the piano again recently. Um, I sent you a video when I like learned that song, but I'm starting to try to learn Take Me Home Country Roads and it's really fun to play. I have like the right hand down. I just need to learn the left hand half of it. And I'm also kind of thinking about learning how to play the fiddle. Uh, I think it'd be really fun. And I found a fiddle on eBay that's only like $26 and it has good reviews. So I might get one. <laughs> And hopefully by the time that you're back home, it'll like not just sound like screaming when I'm trying to play it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope whenever you're watching this, um, you're having a good day and I love you. Um, I hope to talk to you soon and I'll see you when you get home. Bye.